Hello, everybody. Welcome to the first episode of Mod Review. <laughs> okay, so now today we, we we are reviewing the Saturn Five Parts mod. Uh, okay, now this is a pretty cool mod that that, that I'm going to show you. Okay, now now this was made by by Brioche or uh, Brioche or person. <laughs> I forgot. <I> don't know. <laughs> But, uh, okay, now this is a very, very, very cool mod, and as you can see on the side here, it is, you know, you can just see some beautiful, wonderful detailed parts. Now, what we do here is we're going to turn on, uh, cheats, um, every single cheat here, uh, like, <laughs> uh, no heat damage, because, you know, okay. Okay, so now, uh, okay, so now the first part... Okay, so yeah, so here. Okay, so now when you download this mod, which which is uh, uh which is gonna be uh in in the description, uh, so you can download this for yourself. Uh, okay, so now so, so now when you download this mod, there's gonna be two there uh, uh you know two categories here. Now first of all, we got the Apollo spacecraft with the lunar module and and the CSM, and then for the second one's gonna be the Saturn V rocket itself. Now. Now, first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to look at the Saturn V. So now, first thing that we got here is the F1 engine. Okay. Now, 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 this engine is very, very detailed. Uh, and if we look at it here, uh, it, its efficiency is 210 ISP, mass 12 tons, thrust 680 tons. Very, very good. Beautiful. I like it. Okay. Okay, so now next thing that we have here uh, is just like the Saturn V uh, uh, S1C thrust structure. <laughs> oh, mass 150 tons and liquid fuel one, one, 135 tons. Very, very detailed. Okay, so now, uh, uh, okay, so now uh, as, I'm, as I'm doing this, I'm going to assemble it too. Okay. Oh, yeah, I think it's a good technical difficulty. Let's, there we go. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay. So now, second part. Uh, okay. So the third part that we have here is the S1C fuel tank. It's very, very big. Uh, mass 700 tons and liquid fuel 230 tons. Okay. Yeah. So now. Uh, okay. Yeah. So here uh, we got the separator here. Uh, as as to have interstate. <laughs> uh, and now it it's just a separator. Uh, and then for that here at the sides here, uh, we got a, a, a interstage uh, Eulogy motor here. Now this will, yes, yeah, so now that goes on to the sides, I think. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah, so now here we got the, okay, so uh, here we got the S2 thrust structure. Uh, uh, thr thrust stru uh, structure. And and I'm and, and I'm not even gonna read out the uh, uh, you know like how much it could, it it has that much you know the quick quick little review, review, review. Ah, okay. now <laughs> okay uh, so now uh, and after that here we got the S S two fuel tank very very beautiful detailed piece here as you can see like it it has even like the the little the, the little part that goes out very very detailed. And then after that, this is this is probably like one of my favorite parts in, in this pack. Like everything in this pack is my favorite. Uh, okay, so now this is the S the the S four B interstage. Uh, uh, and it also has like a rocket shooting out of it too. And then uh oh yeah uh and then for that here oh, we got the 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 rocket J two engine. Uh, and then that that just goes here. So. Okay, put those very really beautiful pack, and then that, and then one just goes there for, for the S4B. I think it goes down here. Okay, so now, now we're getting into the S4B. Now, S4B is like the the best part, man. Best part. Okay, now this is the S4B thrust structure here. Very very beautiful. Like I I literally cannot like. This is just amazing. Then after that, uh, and then after that, here on the sides, uh, we got, uh, oh, we got the uh, S4B Eulage motor. 
I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. <laughs> that just goes on the sides. And then for that here, oh, we got the S4B fuel tank. Very nice, very nice. And then on the top here, uh, I think this is the instrument unit. Yep, I'm correct. Okay. Yeah, so now basically, so like that's just like the Saturn V done now, which is pretty nice. I, I really like it. This is, this is beautiful. This is amazing. Okay, so now, okay, so now we're moving on to the Apollo spacecraft, which is just what you're about to see. This is going to blow your mind, seriously. Blow it. Blow it away. Like, look at that. Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now, okay, yeah, so now here, here we got the uh, spacecraft LEM adapter, you know, so now like, uh, so so I think this top part uh, goes, like, this top part separates, but this bottom part stays the same, and I think, well, wait. oh yeah, no, okay, no, you can't close the button, okay, okay, so now, okay, so now, wait, is this a separator? Yes, it is, okay, so now, Okay, so now that that one goes there, I think. Does it? No, no. I'm gonna just like put that like right here. Okay, yeah. So now, uh, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna do the lem on the side. Okay. So now, uh, okay, yeah. So now, uh, here we're gonna work on the lem. Okay. Now, the lem. Okay. So now this this right here is the lunar module descent stage. I should have known that already. But like I thought the whole thing was the learn module descent stage. I thought I thought this would be named something else because it's the core. But okay, so now this is the uh, descent engine. I, I thought it would be named something else. Uh, and after that, here are the landing legs. So now the landing legs are are, are like if if I had to choose, the the whole entire limb would be the best would be the best piece. So now uh, okay, so now this is this is the limb. Uh, landing legs here and now these are just I love it <laughs> just just look at that look at that oh yeah okay <laughs> okay and then after that uh, okay so now for the ascent stage uh, we have the ascent engine I guess it's gonna be called yes and then for that here we have the the LEM ascent stage yeah lunar module ascent stage um, and then for that, this is the LEM docking port. Now, it's just so detailed. <laughs> this is probably, like, like, um, like this, this doesn't even look like SFS, you know, this looks like, like, uh, you know, like one of those, like, like concept art. It's not concept art. This is real, like, like, I just love the texture on this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, uh, okay, so now we're just gonna put that into the, to the, into the ascent, in, in, into that, <laughs> uh, into the, uh, interstage there. Okay, so now we're moving on to the CSM. Why'd you even select it? What? Okay. I didn't even select it. How, 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 what? I don't, okay. Uh, okay, so now this, this right here is the service pr propulsion system engine. <laughs> so now... This is beautiful engine, <laughs> and then after that, this is like the uh, the the service module, and then this is the I guess separator. Yeah, Apollo. Wait, what? Yeah, yes, yeah, service module decoupler, and then this is the the um the the reentry shield. Then this is the command module. Now this is like also very very nice. I love it. I love it. Yeah, Apollo command module. And then after that, now, now this is, now, now for accuracy, like, this is, like, this is, this mod is very, very accurate. Okay, so now the, the parachutes would, would usually go in here. And it does. It does exactly that. The parachutes do go in there. And for some reason, there's only two, even though there's three. What? I don't know. I'm not complaining. Okay. So now this is the fo the forward heat shield. Okay, so so now basically what would happen is while the while the command module is is re-entering, the the uh, this piece here would would just like you know would, would detach and then you know like while it's inside like like while it, like already when it re-entered. Okay, so now here's the docking port. Very very beautiful. Let me see if I can zoom. Okay, now this is also very very detailed. 
yeah, Ducking Pro. And then this is the Launch Escape system, which is which is beautiful, just beautiful. And then that, and then the whole entire thing would just go on to there. There you go. What? Oh wait, no, I think this is supposed to go in more. Okay. Wait. No, no, because that's supposed to go like that. Okay. There you go. Okay, so now we're going to see this thing in action. Okay, so now that's the entire Saturn V. So beautiful. Okay. Okay, so now this is the launch. Uh, okay, uh, I also got another mod. I'm probably gonna showcase that one in the next video, cause that cause that mod is also pretty pretty good. Okay, and I think it was the first mod. But oh wait, no, I forgot the I forgot the RCS. Wait, <laughs> we have to talk about the RCS. Oh no. Okay, yeah. Here. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so now this is the uh, yeah service module RCS. Yeah, so now that would ju just go like right here. I think yeah, up there. Okay. There we go. Speed run. Okay, so now, uh, okay, so now let me just turn on no gravity for a second. Oops. Uh, <laughs> this is usually how it is when I record my SFS videos. <laughs> okay, so now, I, okay, so now I didn't make a uh, thing. Also, also, my mouse is really, really weird, you know, like the scrolling wheel just, sometimes it just goes back in for some reason. Uh, yeah, so you can see that a lot. Okay, so now, so now let's just, okay, so now lift off. Now, let, let's just take a look at that plume, though. Look at that. That is just insane. You know, it's, it's, it's so realistic to, to the real... Uh, you know, to the real F1 engine. Okay, so now we're just gonna separate that now. How do... Okay, yeah. So now, so now this would separate. You know what? And then for that, like, like usually, you know, like that would run out of fuel, and it just did. Um. Okay. And then, and then for that, usually, like this stage would 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 uh would ignite, and then uh you know for a bit. Oh, uh, it's not letting me ignite it. Uh, we're gonna get closer. Oh, which okay, okay, yeah. So now this uh, okay. So now this stage would ignite. Uh, I I think you already know how it is by now. Okay, so now you guys, look at this insane plume. You know, like this is a J two uh, vacuum engine. Isn't that just beautiful? Okay, so now what would happen is now this this uh this this service module would turn on and then you know but uh let me clear it. Okay, so now that would usually shoot off but for some reason uh I, I I don't know how to fully use this mod properly so forgive me but okay so now okay yeah so now so now that would happen <laughs> and then and then for that that would and then after that, that would detach, but I forgot to ignite it. I forgot to ignite it. And then after that, okay, so, so now that would, that would base, okay, so now these pieces would just propose, would just push it away. And then, and then after that, the, this stage would ignite. Now, I know this is a pretty garbage commentary here, but that's because, uh, you know, it's the first one. Okay. And like, it's it's very very hard to use this mod because like the mod like you, you click uh, stuff and also it would be like much easier if I had the uh, the 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 stages already in you know but then I'd have to like do that myself and I don't have time <laughs> okay so okay yeah so now since since we're here so okay so now basically so now what would happen is those two would would go like always and then now switch to okay. I'm still not fully used to. Uh, Steam, SFS and Steam. I meant the yes, yeah, PC version. Okay, so now I'm just maneuvering here to, and and in the future I probably will do a, a um, oh god, a uh, what is it the, uh, 
uh, a uh, cinematic, you know? And like, I really wish that SFS had like the uh, dynamic shadows, you know, to, to, oh god, wait, no, ah, oh no, uh, to make, uh, you know, to make everything just look better. And, and I will, okay, like, like, literally this mod is just asking for, you know, this mod is asking for somebody to make, like, a, a cinematic or something. You know, like, you know, like, if this was in a, in a RO, then, then, like, if, if, like, SFS was, like, modded, like, to, like, the KSP level, you know, like, this would be one of the first mods to be used, in my opinion. Okay, uh, uh this is so hard. You know, because like the, I don't know why it's so hard. Uh, really hard. Oh shoot, wait, wait. Oh, oh my god, did I forget the docking port in this? I, I, th I thought I put the docking port. No, no, I did put the docking port. Okay. Okay, we can, we can do this. We can do this. Okay. Go that way. It's it's very hard to control the the source the uh, RCS. Okay, so now okay, so that would separate, and boom. That is beautiful. That 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 right like this scene alone is just insane. Like this mod, like you guys have to play this mod. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna start going down, you know, so we can like try to land this thing on the surface, you know, per se. But like, like uh, I think we're gonna have to go to the. I'm probably gonna cut this out. Okay, so now we're going down. Oh no. Wait, uh did I did I turn on okay. I should Oh no. Uh what did I do? <laughs> What did I do? Oh my god. Uh, this is so cursed. It's like the most cursed thing I've ever did in my life. Okay, so now we're just gonna burn up. You know, because... You know, like, all I wanna do is just land the... Land the lunar module. Just land the lunar module. The lunar module. The, the lunar module. You know what I'm saying, man? The lunar module. Okay, and I think we're gonna hit the ground. We probably are gonna hit the ground. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I um, I may have left the the, the parts on. Okay, that that that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Viewer retention. Am I right? Wait, I forgot. Ah, okay, whatever. Okay, yeah. So now basically, what would happen is that the lamb would 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 uh. Would undock with its legs already open. I don't even know why. It's like, what? What just happened? And now, basically, now, so now, what would happen is that the lamb would land on the surface, like usual, like normal. Uh, oh yeah. Let me let me just show you the plume of this engine. This engine has good plume, in my opinion. Ooh, four forward, four forward. Just it's okay. Uh, um. Yeah, so now I was just pretending, okay, now let's just pretend like it's gonna land. Yay. We landed. This is, okay, now, okay, now, just look at it. Okay, now, just imagine this on the moon. This, this is insane. Okay, so now, uh, okay, so now we land on the moon, so now I'm gonna just turn this one off, turn that engine on, separate, and then what happens is that, is that this would go there, and I also have RCS on. It's got very huge gimbal, and I like that. And the plume, like always, is is good. And now, and now, and now, you know what would happen from here? That would dock with the CSM, and then, and after that, CSM would go back to Earth, and then this, and after that, this, uh, a command module here would, would come, uh, cap, sort of capsule, 
would uh, would, would re-enter the atmosphere. And then after that, what will happen is that this will come off. Hello? Hello? Please, please leave. Uh, where did that go? Oh, that guy's up there. Okay. Yeah, now, okay, now that part would go off. For some and it's not going off. Okay. Uh... Well, it, well, well, usually it does enough for that you can deploy the parachutes, but for some reason it's not working. Anyways, so yeah, so now that's the... Okay, uh, anyways, yeah, so now that's the, um... That's the Apollo parts pack. Uh, please, please go check in the description for this mod. And yeah, very, very beautiful credits to the creator. I forgot I forgot I forgot to create anything, but it's it's gonna be spammed in the in, in the description like a hundred times, okay? Uh yeah, so yeah, so that's the sound review part pack mod, bah, parts review <laughs> mod review. Beautiful, beautiful. That that I rate this I, I rate this ten out of ten, okay? And you're like, no, yeah, but yeah, but that's so that's so much. Seriously, like nobody can can make it better than this. I'm sorry. Nobody can make it better. Anyways. Goodbye.